Hello, I am Inez Alea from ToleratedCinematics.com and today is a quick tip on how to stabilize your footage in Adobe Premiere and the right way. I know a lot of people when they import their footage in uh, their timeline, um, they keep existing settings and if you put the warp stabilizer on there, it gives this error message that uh, the clip dimensions uh, should, uh, should match the sequence settings uh, and always we get this and the same error and it's really working on our nerves um, so it's an easy fix actually so what I do is uh, I select my my uh, footage in here in the, in the footage browser if I'm going to project double click on my footage I'm getting a source um, window you can go by window um, and I think it's uh, well somewhere here so uh, source monitor okay uh, so if you double click that it will open up here I will scrub through until I find my uh, starting point press I on the keyboard and then I scrub forward and press O on the keyboard okay so now I'm going to imp uh, uh, drag this complete comp and drag it to a new layer so you just click drag and put it on here and now we have a whole new sequence from that footage only so now if you're going to affect warp stabilizer we are analyzing in the background everything is fine you can tweak the settings um, and then you can delete this one here just go to project and import that sequence over here and then you can keep existing settings and there we go it's stabilizing and we have it in our timeline so that's an easy quick tip um, but many people are struggling with this so I thought I'd make a video okay so I hope you enjoyed this uh, little quick tip if you did uh, hit it a like button on the video subscribe for more and always leave questions in the uh, comments below um, I will see what I can do okay bye